everybody. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you're having a great day. I have got so much to do today because next week I'm getting ready to go out to Colorado Springs to visit my grandson. And so today I had a tons of stuff I have to do. And unfortunately, I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. And the reason I didn't get a lot of sleep last night is because, okay, so my husband's on the road a lot. Yesterday he was home, just had so much to do. Um, we wanted to be in bed by 10 o'clock because we had to be up early this morning. But we, yesterday, one of my daughters is doing a cow for 4-H and it had to be castrated and dehorned and we had to do that. And then we had play practice and then we had my other daughter who's 16 and she's saved and saved and saved and she's done horses. She's in the U.S. Pony Club and all this stuff. Um, she's actually going to be doing a post about Green Marsh Farms here in Fort Wayne. Anyway, well, she's getting a horse and um, they had to pick it up today. They left at six o'clock this morning, but we had to borrow a trailer and get the lights. And of course my husband, if any of you have ever dealt with a trailer, you know what it is when you plug in the lights and uh, blinkers don't work, brakes don't work. So he was up till about 12.30, he came in at getting that done. And so it was about one before we got to bed. So woke up six this morning and I need a little caffeine, but I would like to do it in a healthier way. So today I'm going to talk about um, a recipe called the shrinker. This is a trim and healthy mama recipe. I want to make sure I give credit where credit is due. And uh, this is made with oolong tea. Now oolong tea is called the skinny tea because it actually increases your metabolism for up to two hours after you drink it. It also is, um, I'm going to put on my glasses here, it's used to sharpening your, th your thinking skills, improve your mental alertness. It contains polyphenols, okay? So polyphenols do several things. Um, they, one thing they do is they act as a prebiotic in your gut, so it increases healthy gut bacteria. And the other thing they do is they increase an antioxidants, which um, prevent the um, overrun of free radicals that can cause degenerative issues with your tissues, and then you can have, I mean, anywhere from Alzheimer's to heart disease to cancer. So anytime you can eat foods with, uh, that are high in antioxidants, you're helping yourself. So we've got the oolong tea. Um, we're gonna use some uh, Himalayan salt, some Ceylon cinnamon. Cinnamon too, again, has such great um, health properties. Um, you've got, um, it lowers blood sugar. It's, it's, they say it's the healthiest spice on earth. Well, I suppose you hear that all the time. Um, it's, it too is filled with antioxidants and it's anti-inflammatory. It benefits the skin. It can help with allergies. I'll link um, an article to uh, the health benefits to both this and long tea um, to the link with the video. And then for a milk, uh, it's best to use a nut milk if you're dairy free. This is unsweetened cashew milk. You could use almond milk, coconut milk. Um, again, if you're trying to be dairy free or kind of you know keep your calories down stick with an unsweetened tea. All right, I mean, an unsweetened nut milk. Okay, so basically you open two tea bags. I've already done the tea because what you do, you know, you boil your water, put your two tea bags in there, let it seep, let it seep till whenever you get to it. I mean, I've let it seep for five minutes and I've let it seep for two hours just because I got busy so I'm doing something else. So you just take, take that out. And I only filled up the mug to about right here with water. Just put that in your blender. Um, you could probably do this with an emergent uh, 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 stick blender too if you didn't have one. Okay, I love my Vitamix. I've had a Vitamix for 15 years and it wasn't even broken and my husband got me another one. Um, but they're amazing, amazing, amazing. I can't recommend it highly enough. Some people do a half a cup, some people do a cup, whatever you want to do. I like it a little bit cre creamier. I've got, I don't know, maybe three quarters of a cup there. And then, I remember when I first started making it this, I hardly put any cinnamon in it. And then I went and made it for my mom. She's like, oh, put more cinnamon in there. And now I love it. I put a teaspoon of cinnamon. And this is Ceylon cinnamon. There's actually two different kinds of cinnamon, Ceylon and Cassia. And um, they're both good for you. But if you use a lot of cinnamon, you might want to stick with the Ceylon because it has less of, um, let's see, it's called coumarins in it. And so if you're eating tons and tons of cinnamon, as with if you're eating tons of anything, I don't care how good it is, um, it can have an effect on your liver. So Ceylon cinnamon. And then I just do a sprinkle of the good Himalayan salt. I don't know, salt like that. And then I don't really measure. I'm just kind of a throw it in. 
So I put in a little maple. I don't think, sorry, I have to put my glass on again. I don't think um, this is in like the trim healthy. I put like, I don't know, that much maple and about that much vanilla, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, maybe a little more. So just throw that in, whatever it is. And then I use two teaspoons of the Trim Healthy Mama Sweet Blend. You can also use um, Truvia. That you can find at any Walmart, probably any store, the Truvia. Um, and so there's one, this I do measure out. One, two. And this is so good. It's just, you think, wow, that's weird. I think in the original Trim and Healthy Mama recipe too, they put in cayenne pepper. Um, again, cayenne pepper is really good for you. I just didn't like the flavor of it, so you just whip this up. And fill up a mason jar, okay? We live off mason jars. Uh, if you, all my kids, I um, have a, a pint size, uh, mason jar with a different color rubber band so they all know what there is and the reason I years ago I just started doing it because everybody's taking cups out of the counter or whatever so I'm just like okay that's it here's your color this is yours because these can fall they can fall on the floor they can just whatever they're just a party so if you don't have a mason jar go go buy some they're very good they're very good or find something that's good so fill that up with ice and then just pour this in now my tea was a little hotter earlier because normally your tea is going to be hotter so it would have melted more but because we were having some issues with the camera the tea has sat for a little while but anyway fill that up to the top and then if you need to add you should add more water i'm just going to come over here and you add more water and just stir that up and oh let me tell you this is so good mm. Mm. This is better than anything you can get at Starbucks. And it's so much healthy for you. Lowering blood sugar, um, filling your body with antioxidants, making you, make, boosting your metabolism. You can't beat this. And yes, it does have caffeine. Don't you want to drink this at, at uh, 8 o'clock at night because you will be up till 4 in the morning. But it's a great way to get your um, caffeine and fortify your body as you do it. So I hope you have a great day. Go and take your skills and what you know best and go fortify your world. We'll see you at the next video. Thanks for stopping by. Quick addendum to that last video. I just finished making this and my girls are over here and they're like, oh, quick, can I have some? That smells so good. So now we're gonna go make a double batch so everybody can have some. So go enjoy. Thanks for stopping by.